where you've got your new job, the job you always dreamed of. Um, whenever you go into your new office, again, it's nerve-wracking and everything's new to you. One of the, the key things that I would say is, um, listen, you know, you're not going to know your job within um, the first week. You know, sit back, get to know your team, get to know what the different personalities are like. Obviously, you've got a new job to learn. So the key thing is to, to listen, be positive, um, and obviously come across as being very eager. Well, if you're a new start and it's your first day, you obviously want to make the right impression. But in reality, you want to make the right impression every day. Um, but I suppose some simple tips are, you know, be yourself, first of all. You want to make a very good impression because the old saying, first impressions count, is very true. You know, smile, be positive, have a really good, fresh attitude. It's a new challenge, it's a new opportunity, so there should be nothing but positivity in your thoughts and your minds. You want to be engaging with your new colleagues, you want to be connecting with them. So mix it up in the coffee, beside the coffee machine, talk to people, generate an interest, find common ground, same football team, kids go to the same school, whatever it may be, make a bond with someone because you don't know how that will help you know, to, to induct yourselves in, into the company. I think there are some really simple things uh, when you arrive on your first day to create that good impression. I think you are prompt, uh, punctual, uh, you're turning up at the right building. A lot of people will turn up at the wrong building if you're going to work for a large organisation. Um, you're dressed appropriately. I think I also really like to see the applicant that's been in touch with me a week or two weeks before they're due to join to say, is there any reading that I can do before I get here to help me get up to speed? Is there anything you want me to start to think about and look at in the first few days? Um, so, you know, be keen, be proactive, try to understand quickly how you're going to add value to your um, boss and, and to, the, to the new company that you're just about to start. On the first day, it's really vital to make a good impression. So new starters should be there on time, if not a little bit earlier. Um, also, ask lots of questions find out who everybody is, be really polite, be very pleasant to everybody you meet. If you can get your hands on a seating chart or an organisational chart, that really helps to sort of remember who's who and where's their seat in the company, etc. Remember that first impressions come before the first day. So once you've accepted a job, make contact with the employer. Uh, it's very unusual for a job to be offered one day and for a person to commence the following day. So it might be a good idea uh, to make contact by telephone or email uh, and tell the employer that you are looking forward to joining them. Uh, perhaps get some induction information or health and safety information uh, so that you are fully briefed on day one. When you're going through that actual day one induction, what you should do is understand what it is that is, is expected from you in terms of the milestones that you need to achieve in day one, in week one and by the time of your first review. Also, make sure and introduce yourself. It's important to remember that work has a social element to it and the people that you're going to be working with are people that you'll spend more time with than your family and your close friends. Finally, you've got the job, so congratulations and very best of luck.